Welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. Elon Paul here once again with the Anomaly Mission for the weekend. Uh, I want to thank you all for joining me today and uh, appreciate the like and subscribes if you guys have liked what you've been hearing so far from my channel. We're getting that big push now. Big, big push. We're coming up on 900 subscribers and we're hoping to hit 1,000 before, uh, before too long. Uh, really, really looking forward to that. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, news. Let's get touching on news real quick before we pop into existence here. And uh, we're going to be doing a couple of Minecraft videos with my kids this weekend, as well as with uh, uh, the two youngest ones. We're going to do a new series on Stardew Valley, of all things. I know that's been around a while, and it's something I've been playing for a very long time. But hey, you know, we're looking forward to these kind of things. Uh, it's a nice, fi fun family time, is all I can tell you. Uh, somehow I... I'm stuck inside. Go figure. <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. Uh, I think it's time to go ahead and uh, delete a wall so I can leave this place. There we go. So in case you're wondering, this is just a sneak preview at a place I found that I'm trying to build in a new uh, anomaly... Not anomaly. Sentinel challenge here to uh, get nanites and stuff like that. Looked for a nice bowl-shaped area to try to build something in them. It's not having a, such a good time of it, so let's go ahead and get out of here. That was just a sneak preview of it. But yeah, if you get a chance, I'm going to put out those videos this coming weekend. Um, especially the Minecraft ones, and I know that's not this game. That's okay. But it's, again, the Minecraft one is not so much for... Yeah, thanks for that. Is not so much for the challenge of Minecraft. We've been playing I've been playing Minecraft since it was in, you know, alpha stages for Pete's sake. But no, it's more for the fun with the family. If you like just the to hear uh, family fun and you like to hear kids just uh, absolutely have a blast uh, with each other and we just joke and cut up each other the whole time, by all means, listen to that uh, to those videos. They're just a lot of fun. Um, I'll do another video with my son in regards to uh, just me and him playing Minecraft. We're trying to get to the Ender Dragon at this point, but we're realizing we were un unprepared, and we needed to get a little more prepared for that. And then finally, on Saturday night, we're going to get a couple more videos going. Uh, one of them will be about Stardew Valley. And Stardew Valley specifically, um, we're going to be doing a complete, full-on, all-cheats-available type thing. So we're going to have some fun here. As you can see, I've got the multiplayer turned on. Um, love those ships. I love the exotics, of course. So, and you know what? I don't have my multi-tool on me. Why in the world do I have the wrong multi-tool? There we go. Staff of office. That's right. All right, good deal. We're all set now. Let's go ahead and get this going, then. Let's see what kind of anomaly video we've got today. Looks like some other people are already uh, doing this. Mess of Bones, good to see you. Okay, let's see what we got. Unusual Minerals. We got some launch fuel out of it, and of course the 1800 Quicksilver. So let's go ahead and do this, initialize, and start immediately, because I don't really want to see if I can get uh, everybody joining me. I just want to do it on my own here, so that's good. All right. Doesn't look like we have a group going. No, that's not my ship. <laughs> my ship is over here. Looks very much like it. Am I wrong? No? Huh? Yeah, I'm wrong. <laughs> Completely wrong. All right, and in case you're wondering, this is not my usual ship. This is my speed, this is what I call my sport version. This sucker is really, really fast. I'll show you a little bit of that when we get down to the planet. So it looks like they want some minerals from us. Now, um, we're going to check out what kind of minerals it wants in just a moment. And uh, before we even get to the planet, we may have already got what it wants, but we'll see. But I got a trick for that. I've got a trick for that. I was just thinking about it. That's why I was quiet. How am I going to get past this? All right. Where are we going? That way. Okay. Now, before we do that, let's just take a little bit of a perusal through here and check it out. Uh, let's see. Sort of raw materials. Request travelers to harvest a number of exotic substances to replenish the anomaly supplies. Interesting. Does it tell me what I'm looking for? Fecium. It wants fecium. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> We're going on a poop hunt. 
Fantastic. Well, you know, I've got kids. Uh, first thing I want to do is I'm going to pull in my freighter. Okay. Second thing we're going to do is I'm going to go into my exosuit inventory and I'm going to look for Ephesium, which we have some here. Go to the freighter. Check the main inventory, make sure we don't have any. We don't. So I'm going to go over to the raw materials area and I'm just going to drop it in here. And then... Dismiss. The freighter. See? All gone. Alright, now we'll go over to the planet. So this way, it doesn't think I have enough Fesium to fulfill the mission, see? But you can't just put it in your freighter, because you can access your freighter's main inventory from anywhere in the universe. However, you can't access your cargo until... unless the freighter is in the same planetary system as you. So that's something you can, uh, you, you can do that. Alright, so here we are. Ginorma... Ginorma Minor. That just kind of goes against each other, doesn't it? So, before we land, I wanted to show you this. Let's go back to first-person view. You see my speed? This thing does almost does about 400 knots. Now, remember that uh, little thing you can do with your engines and you can divert power? Let's see how fast we can get our power going. Weapons drops down to 366. Engines, 452. Whoa, we're going to hit a mountainside. <laughs> All right, and just to show you what this thing can do, this thing is a very, very fast ship. Let's get things cleared up so you can see how fast this thing can really go. And it's very responsive. The maneuverability in this is incredible. To the point where as you're flying, as you, as you turn as much as you can, you can literally slide this ship around stuff. It is absolutely hilarious. There you go. Look at that. I am literally flying sideways right now. Yeah, until I hit a rock. That's okay. Let's go ahead and land and let's get this thing done. Um, this looks like a good enough spot. It looks like it's kind of a depressed area. So let's go ahead and drop in. Hopefully we can get some animals to show up. Enough lollygagging, as they say. Now, it looks like the music might be a little loud, but hopefully you can hear me well past the music. Um, hi there, um, unidentified plant. So we need to make sure that we have in our inventory a way to feed these animals. Uh, where is it? I know I just looked right at them. There they are, right down here. We got creature pellets 32. We need to collect 535 fecium, and that is the best way to do it. Now this planet, if you look at it, its resources are activated copper, pyrite, salt. We could go to a planet that has um, other types of it, uh, uh, actually has fecium deposits if we wanted to. All right, looks like we got one guy over there. I am not seeing a ton of animals here. And those are flying creatures. They aren't going to help us at all. Oh, we got another one over here. Okay. He's dangerous. And removed... He's, his, his diet is removed hearts. Well, I know some sad people who would be... Uh, I don't know. That's, that's a bit much, I know. Uh, what is my... Let me see here. What do we have this set to? I don't have it set to anything. Let's set this to six on my thing. See, he's already attacking. And we've just offered him food, and he's curious. Look at that. So we got some attack creatures here, so keep that in mind. Let's see what this one has. Wildly aggressive, and he likes coagulated blood. And he's going to eat some, too. So it looks like we got a couple friends here. Now, what we're interested in is when they poop. <laughs> what about you? Dangerous and removed hearts as well. That's fabulous. Nice to know we have these wonderful creatures near us. And also, we got to be careful of these. Do not pick those up, okay? Any more creatures around here? Doesn't look like we have a whole lot around us. Oh, we're about to be attacked again. Let's go ahead and... Hey, buddy. Watch this done he's not going to attack me anymore isn't that great so this is going to make it difficult so these creatures are going to want to attack you but if you feed them one by one that at least be something now look around if they do poop what you will get is you'll get a pile of it and it will show up on your scanner so hopefully this works i remember in the expedition it did not work at all so it's it really sucked 
but we thought we would need the VCM to, uh, you know, plant stuff, but we ended up not needing it, so at least that was something. Looks like we got another creature up here. How big is that one? Okay, he just seeks company. He's just a happy guy. Okay, anybody? Anybody? No, huh? We're literally not getting poop from anybody. That's not good. I'm going to go ahead and scan this creature up here anyway, just because. Is there any grazers? Let's go up there to the grazers. Let's go ahead and check them out. Offer him food and see what happens. Hot planet, so make sure you have the shielding for it. Oh, well, look at that. we got some more creatures that are getting friendly towards us. So I think it's the grazers that will do it. I don't think the ones that have that like the coagulated blood and stuff like that, the aggressive animals, I don't think they're going to give you much. And there's a sentinel. What are they like on this planet? Threatening. Okay. I don't know if he's going to attack me or not, but he's just kind of hanging out there. Still looking for poop, not seeing any. Biological entity there. Intelligent and collects seeds. That's nice. What does this guy have? Where did he go? He's that big. How could he have disappeared? Come on now. There he is. Seeks company. Produces crab apples. Well, why isn't he producing poop for me? So we may have a problem here. And the sentinel seems to be stationary doesn't seem to want to do anything. Very interesting. So we seem to be running into an issue. It looks like this may not be working at all. Let's get down in here. See if there's any more creatures around here we can try. Yeah, just what we need. More storms. There was a whole host of creatures over here. Likes roots. Let's go ahead and check this guy out. Alright, see that's another sentinel, except this guy is... He's looking around, but he isn't coming after me either, so I don't know what's going on. I don't know if they, I mean, they're threatening, but I don't know. I don't know. This is kind of weird. And again, I am not seeing anybody dropping any feces, so we've got a little bit of a problem here. I'll just go ahead and drop a seed down. What about you? Are you going to poop for me? Now, this, is, this is harder than when I was diaper training my children. Good grief. Trying to get him toilet trained. Why couldn't you be like a cat? You just show him a litter box and they take care of business. That's what I need. I needed a litter box, right? Hey! We have a dung sample. Guess what? 15. Yay! What about you? You were mean. So I need to look for creatures that primarily do seeds okay that's interesting this is going to make this a little bit tougher all right let's get out of this get down here a little bit see if we can find some more creatures here nope not the birds inorganic object fabulous so we're not getting attacked at least that's something He's the other mean dude. What about you? Alright. That one has seeds, so we're going to see if they can drop some poop. Okay, so I'm not getting attacked. But very, very odd. They're not treating me very, very... They're just kind of hovering around. They're angry, but they're not calling in support. Beginning to wonder... 
So this is going to take a little while. We need 535 of this stuff. So I'm curious about something. Let's check something in the planetary area. No, and nobody else has actually checked out the other planets to see if any of them have Fesium. Because that would be hilarious. If we had a planetary system in here that had Fesium, we would be all set. I'd call in my freighter and check it out, but that would cause me a problem. Come on, let it loose, pal. Oh, he made a noise. There it is. And that's all you're going to get me. Another 15. 18 that time. Okay. So this is going to take an inordinately, incredibly annoying amount of time. Unless you can find a whole bunch of those grazers. They're the only ones that drop the fecium. And again, you got to have that thermal protection. Else, it'll take care of business on you, that's for sure. What about you? Highly intelligent plant roots. Oh, you're a little guy. That's all you are. Good. We'll give you some food, too. Alright. So, as you can see, this is going to take an incredible amount of time. Um, what I might do... Hi. What's up? How you doing? Both of you standing right here. You already dropped some. That's good. No, I don't want to interact with him. There we go. Yeah, this is going to take a while. Get my life support up. Oh, you know what I just did? I think I just pissed somebody off. There we go. Sorry, man. I wasn't trying to kill anybody, honestly. Let me see if I uh, actually took in some... Yeah, I accidentally killed <laughs> Dude. Alright. We've only gathered 62 fecium, though, so we've got an issue here. This is going to take an incredible amount of time to do that. So let's try something here real quick. We can always come back to the planet, right? So let's try leaving this planet. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and bite me. That's okay, I don't care. Lots of angry animals. And off we go. Let's check out the other planets real fast and see if any of them have fecium deposits. Because as long as you don't leave the system, you can do whatever you want. So you, let's scan you. You have copper, right, salt. What else we got out here? Got another planet over here. What about you? What do you have? You have paraffinium salt. Okay, good. I bet you anything this system doesn't have anything else. What about you? Activated copper, power, salt, and aggressive sentinels to boot. And then you got this little planet over here. Wrong button. Who knows what I just activated? Oh, you dog. Let's try it again. Moved just a hair. Shell strewn. Is that everybody? I think that's everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six. We got six planets. I think I've looked at five. So one, two, three. And then. You're four. You're five. Oh, there's a planet beyond you. You have a moon on the other side of you. All right, let's check it out. I'm willing to give it a shot because if we can find fecium deposits, we can go ahead and, uh, you know, just mine it real quick and be done. I mean, you have to go to the planet first. You have to go to the planet that they tell you to go to first. Get there first. But unless they have fecium over here, the alternative is, is that now that you know what you need to get because you watched this video... Man, look at that. I had to go all the way over here to get to this planet. Because you went all the way over here, because you watched my video, you know you'll need Fecium, so get it in advance. Nope, we don't have anything. So this is going to take a long time. Um, Aaron Planet. Okay. 
So I guess we're just going to have to grin and bear it, as they say. All right, let's head back to the planet we were at. All right. Looks like we're kind of bouncing back and forth between these two. Yeah, yeah. All right. So basically it's a moon. This is a moon. I wonder if we have a better time of them. Let's try something here real quick. Let's drop down to this planet real fast here. Can't understand why the Sentinels are not attacking me. Now, I don't know if it was a glitch and I'm about to fix it. But we shall see. So there he is. But he's not attacking. While we're here. There we go. Just get a little extra while we're here. I am going to look for as many of these creatures as I can. So this is going to turn out to be a little longer of a period of time than I thought. To take care of this mission. So why don't we do this. I'm going to pause the video. And we'll come back. We'll come back when I've gathered all the Fecium. Okay? Okay. Does that sound good? I think that sounds good. Because who, who wants to watch me picking up poop the whole time? I know I don't. That's just no. Let's just say that that's a no. How about we say no? No, I say no. No, we're not going to do that. Okay, be back with you guys in just a moment. Okay, and we're back. So we're going to go ahead and get our, as you can see, I've got my uh, 550 is what I ended up with. So we got enough. We're going to go ahead and get out of here and head over to the structure it tells us to go to. So again, that takes a long time on this planet. And it doesn't look like the Sentinels, even though they're supposed to be attacking me, they're not attacking me. And I don't know why. So we're going to deliver the goods. It looks like really close by. Hold on. Whoa. Okay. Is that an approximate? Um, you want me to deliver it right to that spot. Okay. I'll drop right here. Okay. I see nothing here. Let's do this. Okay, that way. I think. There we go. Okay, so it's over there. Go right past him. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, hold on. Oh, it's right up there. Okay. Weird. Oh, okay. How come I didn't see? Well, probably because of the storm. I couldn't see it. And we made it. Hey, landing platform's open. So, we'll call on my starship. There we go. We just got rid of the storm. Oh, boy. This is some planet, huh? All right. And it looks like we got to go right here. Okay. Excellent. Delivery lockbox prepared. Accessing. This must be Polo's secure lockbox. I should deposit the item and register my delivery. It would deliver 500 VCM. So we just, we only needed the 500. Processing. Success. You're done. You're done. That's it. And now we can get out of here. And it only took me, uh, you yeah, know, a lot longer than I wanted to. All right. No problem, though. So we're out of here. We're going to go back to the Nexus. The Anomaly. Nexus in the anomaly. You know what I mean. Go ahead and call it in one more time. Yeah, I seem to have a problem with the intermix on my... Uh... There we go. 
All right, in we go. Again, multiplayer's on, so a little bit of a drag on the resources here. You'll see a lot of people popping up in here. Darwolf is in here. That's nice. Okay. And we're done. Let's head back, and we're going to check out what's available in the Quicksilver store as well. As well. As well, as well, as well. All is as well. Okay. Turn in our mission. Complete. We're done. 1,800 more Quicksilver. So, there we are. Running a little low, as we can see. Enemy Slayer. Master Queef. Silver Companion. Okay, so let's see what we can create. Looks like the Plasma Jetpack jet Trail is now available. Tier 5 is about halfway done, so that's good. We'll get the fusion power after that. So let's see what this one does for us. Okay. Now we're wearing a cape, I believe. Yes, and I did, as you can see, I changed my appearance a little bit. I was getting tired of that wacky-looking Aeron one that was just too big. And it looks like everybody wants to use this to see what the Jetpack Trail looks like. Interesting. So, we'll go ahead and use it as well. Just real quick. Backpack. We're going to go ahead and turn off our cape. And we're going to go ahead and turn on... I like the streamlined. And we're going to go with the plasma trail. Okay? Yes. And we're off of here. Let's see how it looks. I don't know. I think that looks pretty good. I kind of like it. All right, let's see what it looks like with the flowing cape. Backpack. I'm going to go back to my organic freighter cape. Okay, we're done. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'm, I'm looking forward to see what the fusion one looks like. Because I'm really interested in all the lightning bolts and stuff that have come out of it. But we'll keep this one for now. That looked pretty good. So again... Got some more videos coming out, folks. Watch for the Minecraft ones if you're interested in just the camaraderie. Just in, interested in seeing how my, me and my kids get along with each other. And it is hilarity, usually, in most cases. So that, that's really, really a lot of fun. So I'm going to go ahead and save this. Research point. There we go. Restore point saved, and we're all done. So we'll do this again next week. We'll go ahead and get the Anomaly video going, and we'll do a couple more uh, uh, videos next weekend. We may even stream next weekend. So keep an eye open for the other videos. Again, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Again, hit that like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.